morning, good morning, gals and guys. Yep, let's get our day started. We're just gonna go ahead and get out of this flying J. We were in the prime parking, as you guys probably knew. Now it's time to get out of here and uh, get down to the customer. Yeah. See if we can get unloaded. Oh yeah, that is a bigger parking lot than what I thought it was. Like when I was only that deep, it uh, didn't look like it was that big of a parking lot. But they said there's 200 parking spots here, so I guess it is bigger than what it looks. So uh, yeah, we're getting out of here. We got 22 miles to go according to RJ to make it down to. Uh, our delivery well that's a dead end road there so all right well so here we go let's make our way down to the delivery place and let's see what kind of reload we will get after that i still haven't gotten anything yet as far as so far anyways but look at the green grass over here to the right eh there's still some green grass that's amazing I wonder what that is. In a half mile, turn yeah. right on SC38. Interesting. Not sure what that is, but hey, <laughs> looks sure kind of interesting. I can say this much: I've never been at this place. Never ever have I been over here in this area. That's for sure. So we're gonna have to find our way down to our delivery. In 1,000 feet, turn right on SC38. Yeah, I don't know why RJ says turn right. It's just the highway splits kind of apart. So there is no right turn here. Do you see any right turns up here? No, I don't. I don't know what he's dreaming of, but anyways. Continue on this road for six miles. There you go. We'll make our way down there and kind of hoping they're going to be happy to see us. Hopefully they'll... Uh, Unload us right away. I mean, we got a couple of pallets probably or something like that anyway. So don't have a whole lot, that's for sure. But anyways, we'll make our way down there and find out what happens, right? Keep you guys up to date on what we're going to be doing. As soon as we know what we're going to be doing, we're updating our website too, right? So that way the website is always up to date. So if you guys don't know how to get my to my website there is a link down in the description box if you still don't get it don't wait till the end of the video and there will be an annotation they're usually on that side i believe and uh you can just click on it and uh it will take you directly to my website you can go check it out bookmark your uh bookmark bookmark my website into your browser and then that way you don't have to go search for it. You can just click on that. It'll take you directly to my website. You might have to just refresh it every once in a while just to uh, you know, check to see if I've updated it, right? But other than that, we're just uh, enjoying the nice warm weather that they have down here. That's for sure, man. They, they got very nice weather. It is a little bit windy. But it is not too bad. All right, guys, we have just gotten unloaded. Yep. Now we're heading back to the Fly and J that was just down road here, but 22 miles to go. Pretty much, we're still in the same town as we delivered, but uh, yeah, we're just going through town and then uh, gonna get out of town, I guess. But. Uh, so far I have not gotten a reload yet. Oh, that's a bit weird how that goes over that railway track there. But yeah. Uh, I have not gotten a reload offer yet, but hey, whatever. I'll have to go back to the Flying J and wait for further instructions, I guess. It's all I can really do, right? Yeah, it's nice though. Look at these trees down here. I, I love that. Like nice, nice little trees here on the side of the road. Oh, that's gorgeous to me. 
I wouldn't mind driving this truck But I've been running too hard For too little pain So I walked in the boss man's room Said I'm gonna need me a raise real soon And threw that big fat cigar This is what he had to say I can only please one person today Today ain't your day So get back in that truck And turn it around Yeah, that door you just walked through Swings both ways And I can only please one person today And today ain't your day Came in off of the road Told my honey I've been pulling a heavy load So could you bring me a drink While I hit the easy chair And the chrome on my truck needs shine It's out there in the driveway When you get time Then I heard her wailing As my keys came sailing through the air I can only please one person today And today ain't your day So get back in that truck Hey, and turn it around Yeah, that door you just walked through Swings both ways And I can only please one person today And today ain't your day can only please one person a day And a day ain't your day So get back in that truck And turn it around Hey, that door you just walked through Swings both ways And I can only please one person a day And a day ain't your day yeah, I can only please one person a day And today ain't your day Tomorrow ain't looking too good either 
Alrighty guys, we have just gotten our load offer here not too long ago and now we're making our way down to North Carolina. Actually, we just entered North Carolina here because let's face it, we were just down the road. <laughs> we we're just into South Carolina, so we weren't really deep into South Carolina. So it was only a few miles and we were in North Carolina already. So, and as you can obviously see, it's drizzling a little tiny bit and so we gotta keep our wipers going but uh yeah we got 160 miles to go yet and we'll be at our pickup place so uh we're picking up a load here in north carolina going to ontario which me and my wife kind of discussed already that's probably what was going to happen anyways because we have that certain type of load that comes out of Toronto, that kind of goes into uh, Winnipeg there. And I cannot talk about what load it is or what it is or whatever, but uh, it is something uh, of high value and we can't talk about it. But anyways, uh, that's what I'm suspecting what I'll be getting out of Toronto to go home on. But in the meantime, we gotta focus on uh, getting this load picked up and then hammer down to Toronto and uh, hopefully I can just drop it at the terminal though like uh, I'm supposed to deliver Wednesday by lunch but if nothing goes wrong I'll be uh, I'll be in Toronto tomorrow night I'm just kind of looking to see what happened over here but almost looks like something went on over here like an accident oh yeah look at that Ooh, somebody must have gotten t-boned or something there Ooh, that doesn't look good Oh well, accidents do happen and they do happen in a split second, so you always got to be prepared. That is correct, and that's why I do have a dash cam in my truck. Very important to me to protect myself or whatever, you know. If I know I ain't doing anything wrong and I have an accident, at least it will be on video and we'll be able to prove it on uh, who was at fault, right? If I'm at fault, then well, throw me in jail. And I wasn't. Then I wasn't at fault. Then I was at fault. You know. Then I deserve the penalty. Simple as that. But uh, yeah, let's get on down the road here and uh, see if we can get our load on. All right, guys, we are here at the customer right now, getting loaded, or we're supposed to get loaded here any minute. I just backed into the dog, right? So that ain't going to do any good saying we're we're getting loaded, right? Should be getting loaded here very soon, but yeah, we're on the dock. And I've been getting hungry, so I went ahead and made me some sandwiches. That's my CB radio over there. They tell us to turn to 15 over here, so that way we can hear everybody. But uh, anyways, let's get us a bite to eat here, and then uh, hopefully we'll be loaded here soon. Alrighty, guys. I am now at a rest area on I-64. Yeah. Took us a good while till we finally got loaded there. I got there at 2.30 central time this afternoon. And uh, I didn't get out of there till quarter to uh, six. So uh, yeah, that's why you probably don't see a lot of driving videos in today's vlog. But hey, maybe we'll get some better shots tomorrow. And uh, yeah, so we are loaded now. We're on our way kind of to Toronto area. So uh, so we're just finishing off our day. I could have driven a little bit further if I wanted to, but uh, I decided, you know what, this is it. And there was actually only one spot left in this rest area here. So uh, I kind of got lucky that I even got the spot. So uh, yeah. The driver here beside me is kind of parked halfway in my parking spot, but the guy beside me there was kind enough to uh, drive forward so I could get in the spot and uh, manage to get in the spot. And here we are, parked for today. So we appreciate you guys watching my vlog today. If you liked it, give me a big fat thumbs up. If you didn't, hey, give me a thumbs down. I don't care. And if you really enjoyed it, hey, do me a favor, share the video. And also, if you're new to our channel, would love to have you on board by hitting that subscribe button. Yes, indeed, we would. So with that being said, we do daily vlogs on general speaking. We do daily vlogs, so uh, hey, you can expect another one tomorrow morning. 
So don't go nowhere. We'll see you right here on the Trucker Rudy Show tomorrow morning. Have a good one. It's time to get going. It's time to move on. Put this behind me. That day is gonna come.